Hello, hello everybody. Welcome. I just wanted to do a little midday try on me getting some questions about this new collection and I just did some new earrings. So I thought I'd try a couple things on, see if we can get some input and we'll see what come. Maybe some updates. We'll do another update soon um, of some new pieces. So I just did these. We've been doing this new Imaginarium collection. I just did whipped up some new necklaces since we had so much fun with the last collection. Uh, which are all gone, so they're all off to the new homes. Hi, hi guys, just saying hi. Trying on a couple things. I just finished these in our Imaginarium collection. I did some, just doing some fun one-of-a-kind earrings. These ones I did with rose quartz and then like an iridescent chain. This is, there's gonna be like one pair of these and maybe one necklace with rose quartz. So these are just some really special one-of-a-kind pieces we're doing with our collab with Michael Butterfield, which is our fundraiser for We Wield the Hammer. And we just dropped a new collection for American Craft Exposition last week, but then I just added some necklaces and then they, we had such good response. I whipped up a couple more, so let's try some on. This one, we just did a, a kind of like a medium size woven piece, breaking apart all the different chains, about 18 inches inside diameter. I finished it with the aluminum chain, which is nice and light too, but the acrylic chain is super light for such a big look. Isn't that cute? Yes. Love that. Kind of like a nice woven thing. I've been thinking about little thin chains compared to like a little bit thicker, chunkier chains and weaving them together and creating this more weave structure. They're all woven together. I'll kind of play with them like kinetic parts. It's really fun. Fun to, I love weaving or doing, as you can tell, everything. The knit chains, it's kind of like where it started. We have one of these left. I should put this back up on the website. Then we have one of these left. This is how it started a couple years ago. Doing all these crochet pieces. Hi. And we just, I did just update. If you can find them, they're little Easter eggs on the website. The chain bra just went up and the poncho just went up got some inquiries about that it's I need to update the sizing but it's available maybe we'll do a gold version too of each you can order the gold in the chain bra and there's like custom measurements because I feel like you're gonna need that okay I digress okay really quick so this is the medium let's look at it a little bit up close double clips aluminum chain this is an aluminum metal chain but super duper light and then this is the acrylic chain down here that I wove with in a gold finish and then also in this clear matte finish, which I'm really loving. You can see all the different sizes of chains. I have like linky oval chains, more like a paperclip style and then more curb, some ovals, some like square kind of cool, like 60 geometric shapes woven in this one. This one's a little bit lighter. I called it like a medium. I got medium, although it is full statement as usual. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ready, ready for you. It's gonna be great. This could be great like year round. I think the colorway especially is really light. It'd be great in the summer, but it'd be a really fun holiday piece as well. Really celebratory, mm -hmm. great with gold jewelry. Okay, there's that one, that's the medium. We also did a little bit chunkier version and I finished this one. This one has three tones in it. It has the aluminum chain again but in a gunmetal finish, still really nice and light. And then I cascade down into this, the acrylic chain again. I just did a little, just a couple more layers of weaving. So this one got a way chunkier. You can see just a little bigger and it has smoky gray with the clear and the gold. And I wove in these gunmetal bits just to kind of create a little bit more of a weave structure in that piece. Again, lots of different shapes going on here. Relatively light though for how, you can hear the jingle, for how heavy it is. Oh, we love, obviously I love, everything I do is like a woven, a woven piece, but you can see the three tones in here. Fills in a little bit more than this sweetie pie, the medium, you can see the size of these two. It's like another layer and probably another three layers, really. It's another layer below and then another couple layers mixed in here to create this a little bit heavier 
weave structure. It's still extremely wearable, just depends on your look. The look this feels a little bit more casual. There's a little bit more negative space happening, especially mm -hmm. with the color. Really cute. Mm -hmm. I love that. I like all the shapes too. So some choices, a little bit lighter. This one has a little bit heavier feel. Really great. It's just definitely balanced. I balance where the gold is, where the like smoky color, where that opaque color is. So it has this really great feel. It lays really nicely too. That's kind of the little touch of it all. Hi. Okay, let's try on a couple of earrings and I'll say adieu. But thanks for coming. Okay. This, this. Okay, we did a couple new earrings. I did. I did some colors. I did this. I did do the red. We talked about doing some red. I brought in a big red piece. Look how cute, or not big, long red earrings. Ooh, loving long red earrings. Probably like seven inches total length. Again, really light. They have a matte acrylic. They're matte acrylics. So they almost look velvety in a way, which is really nice. Finished with a 14 karat gold fill ear hook here. A little bit different shapes. I kind of blended the curb and the Lincoln link chain in there. And they're really, these are very comfortable. I have a lot of movement, really wearable. Oh, they can do that little trick also where you can flip this up, wear it more like a half size, kind of creates a little bit more of a geometric look let's see oh yeah little geometric right oh I like that together like a lo one long one short but the short is good just moves a little bit a little bit softer let me put the other one up too let me do it front ways okay so that one I did I flipped it front. This one I flipped from the back. This one I flipped from the front. Kind of creates a little bit different shape. Kind of fun to experiment with. Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. That has a really beautiful sculptural shape, like fabric. This one feels more geometric. Oh, that's so fun to play with. So every time you do it, it's gonna be a little bit different. This feels like a 3D like sculptural form. Oh, I like the half size. So that's gonna be more in your like 3.5, four inch, still pretty long, but versus remember that really long. Let's see, not really long, but longer. Right? Mm. Hello, welcome everybody. Okay, one more, we did, so I showed you the red, we did red long, we did, we added some new gold ones, I made these humongous bubble ones. These are getting, going up on the website like momentarily. Look at that. Big, big balloon bubbly ones. We had the, we have some, we have some other shapes. We're gonna run out of the gold link ones, the oval ones, so I made some bubbles. Oh, so cute, I love the bubbles. That's probably like five inches almost. Then we did long curve, similar to the red ones in the same length, like seven inch. Look how cute that is, I love that. And this, the long ones have been doing really well. They're very lightweight. They look like, this one is a touch heavier because of the size of it, but still for how chunky that is, if it was metal, it'd be so heavy because it's acrylic, it's really easy to wear, really great look. This one we can do again that doubling up thing so we'll flip it and now isn't that cute okay so you get like two different earrings in one. Oh, I like that okay so I the long ones a lot of versatility more than you think cool let's see okay then I did a special pair which is going up soon because I was thinking okay we're gonna put a two more pairs we're gonna put up these yellow ones I did pastels which is super weird look at this it's like a neon oh clear slash oh a little bit brushed almost 
chain with, I did a gold finish on this. Let's see if we can get closer, yes. This feels like lemon sorbet, like a super bright lemon sorbet. And it, I'm loving yellow as a little extra accessory. It is such a, you know how red can have that little pop? Yellow does that too, just like sports cars that come in yellow so often. It really adds with all black and like some cute neon yellow touches or a little bit of neon touch anywhere. It's just like translucent and frosted. I know, right? Just a little try on here. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, so these are gonna go on the website because, right? Okay, this is our little, we have a miniature drop. So thanks for, if you send me requests, I really do try to fulfill them and make videos for you. Thank you, thank you for asking. I also did mini, some mini curb chains, like some for everyday littles. I thought these would be cute. I have these two sizes right now. Totally one of, kind, one of a kind. We're only gonna be able to put out one or two pairs of each of these. So if you want something, please put requests in. Uh, we have a good options, but on some of the colorful ones, like we're gonna have one of a kind only on the reds and on some of these like more petites, we're only gonna have one of a kind. We're trying, but then you get a really special piece, right? Look at that. These are some great like three inchers. I did the three inches and I did the biggies. But this, if you get the more crazy, if you do the neck piece, then you're gonna want like some cute littles, right? Ooh, cute littles always. That's that. And then that would be maybe the earring. Although I would even maybe see, let's see if we can double up this one. Okay, even cute, oh, okay, love it, doubled. Making, you always want to have little transformative pieces they can wear. Oh, I like it doubled. Okay. Oh, yeah, we needed like a Wednesday moment, right? Been a day. Cute. Okay, so that's the three inches now made into almost uh, 1.75 ish. Oh, yeah. I feel very much ready for holiday. Yeah, yeah. This feels like a holiday piece. This ice and snow, are you guys ready for it? I'm not. It already feels like it in the air. Okay, every time I get on now, not since I'm back in New York, not in California, every time I get on and do a live, I talk about the weather because I'm on the East Coast and you talk about the weather. Uh, okay. Seriously, okay, what else did I miss? I did that, I did that. We shot, I'm gonna show you the red we have left just so just to pique everybody's interest because there's only this much. Maybe one or two more pairs of red, but no more long red. This is kind of what we got left in the red. Aren't these cute? These are the seven. More of these cute like half and half gold. I did a sterling pair because you know, not everybody wants the shiny gold, although I like the shiny gold. Hi, Cindy. Thank you. Yes, I like the littles with the big necklace. You have to have balance, right? But then maybe you're not going to do this and you're going to be more just ba bam with a big earring because that is great. Oh, I love. I also have been loving the clear kind of mixed in with gold as a new humongous earring. Right? Red. And I'm kind of loving like playing, I'm loving playing with shapes, obviously. But I'm, oh yeah, big earrings. And these are so, so much fun. Mm. Okay, this, I feel like we should make this. This should be our next. Because I made this. Well, I was thinking about those pieces I just made. This, these whole new, these whole new things right those reds right I, okay so Francesca I was just saying I only have a couple of the reds left so um can you tell me what you want <laughs> or I'm gonna order I ordered some new parts but I don't know because all the red keeps going but I can only get a little bit so I'm not sure what to get anywho there's a little bit more red coming but on the on this um yeah that's it right now or else it's gonna be like in six weeks maybe Cause we're like, we're, we have to fill orders. We're, we used to, you know, we make things by hand and only go so fast. Okay. 
So I made some clear kind of woven ones, but what if we did a red woven one? Wouldn't that be great? Yeah, okay, I need to make, I think we should make more red earrings and another a red woven one. The red crochet one like this is totally gone and it was so cute. So I think we need some like red iterations in multiple forms. So I have this one. I have one more pink and red coming out. And any requests that you give me, I will try to fulfill. So if you give, put your notes in now. And so I will try to make that all happen. Okay, cool. Because it will be like, you know, four weeks planning, four weeks time. But we, I will make it work. Totally. Yes, totally. Right? Okay. So I did that. I did that. I showed you some reds. I showed you some of the clears. Oh, one more time. I'm going to show you what I started with because I think this is what the next big statement piece I'm going to make is going to be, I have a little bit of this beautiful rose quartz. Look how great the rose quartz matched with that mm, kind of iridescent and translucent. So I made these statement earrings, obviously I had to make them humongous. And even, even with the stone, they're still very wearable. The chain is nice and light, but this with the stone, these are on the, this is the probably the heaviest pair because it has this, mm, but still super fun. Okay, so I have this, right? I'm gonna do this in a big like woven piece and I have a little bit of, I have some cool, I have a couple cool stones to weave in. So what do you guys, like the rose quartz, I, ugh, the rose quartz matched just, it kind of felt like it was meant to be. Yeah, okay. Oh my God, you can see all my like mess down there. Anyways, pretend it's not happening. Okay, I have this, I started it. This is how I started, just start putting chains together and see how it goes. But I have some rose quartz and then look at this very, I have this, just a little bit of this. We have one more mass chain like this coming out. And then a couple more, I have these rose quartzes and these iridescent, uh, titanium plated quartz that make this kind of iridescent thing. I think that with this whole thing, right? What do you guys think? It's gonna be like a whole, that could be something. There's gonna be something there. It's gonna, it's gonna be good. Okay, wait in, wait in while I figure it out. Cause somehow maybe yellow will figure out into, but maybe that's gonna be its own thing. So. A couple more statement pieces coming, not in the red variety in more of these pastels, but a red one will be coming in the future. Okay. Yes. You guys have a great one. <coughs> happy Sunday or happy Wednesday to everybody. Here's some more of those. These just landed. Chain bra just landed on the website. Chain poncho just landed on the website. If you have any questions, let me know.